Here we are now in 2017 at the Gretsch booth with Guitar World. My name's Adam, I'm the Gretsch product manager. And uh, we're looking at the Roots section. We're in the, uh, the acoustic corner of the Gretsch World at the moment. Uh, the Roots is uh, a, a series we introduced a few years ago uh, of really affordable Roots and folk instruments. Uh, we had the mandolins and the banjos and the resonators and all that kind of thing. Uh, this year we are really digging in with some cool acoustic guitars with the same vibe as the rest of the Roots series, kind of that early 20th century really cool thing. Um, with these three acoustics here, aren't they beautiful? All gloss finishes, uh, all solid spruce tops, laminate mahogany back and sides. Let's start with the style one. Little parlor guitar, really lightweight. This has very lightweight uh, uh, quarter sawn spruce bracing. Uh, for maximum projection and resonance. Um, this beautiful Appalachian uh, cloudburst finish, which is very evocative of the era. Um, this particular one being the style one, uh, has quite um, modest appointments in terms of the aesthetics. Uh, just nice pinstripe binding and a sound hole rosette and little snowflake inlays here. Bone nut and a nice rosewood overlay on the headstock and these cream plastic buttons. Very evocative of the era. As I say, beautiful little guitar. Uh, the next one up is the Style 2. Here we've gone with the slotted headstock. Because it's cool. We love the slotted headstock, right? And a little bit more upmarket in the marquetry as well. The herringbone uh, pattern around the edge there and around the sound hole. All these guitars are 12 frets to the body. Again, very authentic to the era, but also it pushes the bridge back a little bit further, makes the top a little bit more resonant. You get a lot of volume, a lot of full sound. Um, again, the Appalachian cloudburst finish, solid spruce top, laminate mahogany back and sides, nice marquetry down the middle. We've also done a satin back of the neck just for ultimate playability, very comfortable to play. Um, so that's the style two. And the style three, the top of the range at this time, is uh, the, uh, probably the deepest of them all. This has, has a really deep body. I should point out that all three of these guitars have different bracing patterns. The bracing pattern is designed specifically for the voice that we wanted for each guitar. Uh, and that goes for the depths of the bodies as well. They all have slightly different depths of body, slightly different design of bracing to make them have a unique voice for each individual guitar. And again, this one being the top of the range has the most, uh, the most fancy um, aesthetic appointments of them all. We've added a pick guard on there. We've got this tortoise shell, uh, uh, sorry, this um, marquetry on the outside in, in the wood uh, and around the sound hole. Got the B&D style inlays up the fretboard, a little bit more fancy, binding on the neck. And then on the top, this tortoise shell overlay on the headstock. It's a little kitsch, but we love it. Uh, binding and the Waverly style tuners. Again, satin back of the neck, laminate mahogany back of the sides, solid spruce top. So lightweight. The, the bracing on here just makes this thing just as light as you can think. And you imagine the resonance that goes with that. Really loud, really full sounding, great little guitars for finger picking, for strumming, whatever you want to do with them. They look cool, they sound cool. They're the, they're the guitar for the guitar player who has everything. So go out and buy one now. This is NAM 2017 Gretsch Guitars with Guitar World. Thanks very much.